Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Pokemon Prism Nuzlocke Edition. <laughs> uh, last episode, we actually made quite a bit of progress. We caught three Pokemon, one of which only has one HP, so we should probably go heal up. Uh, we got Ashley the Ralts, Ariel the Talo, and Zoom the Zubat. Wills three, four, and five. Not too shabby. Uh, let's go heal up real- oh wait, no, we're in the middle of a route. Okay. Let's actually just keep going, I guess. This sign. Oxala City ahead. Southwest for Caper City and southeast for Clathrite Tunnel. Okay. This is Route 72, right? A new new route? It actually does not say. Hold on, let me uh Route 71. Route 72. Okay. Let me open up my document again, because <laughs> I'm a dingus and I forgot. Okay. What can we get on Route 72 here? Hopefully something decent. Another Zubat? Okay, well fortunately we already caught one, so we can go ahead and skip this. Because of Species Claws. I'm gonna run away. And keep trying to find something new. A Pidgey? Uh, not ideal, because we already have another basic bird. But we'll try to catch it anyway. If the Scratch kills, whatever. It does not? Okay. I mean, at the v at very least, if nothing else, we can use it for death fodder. So, in case we need to switch out and heal or something, we can just send Pidgey in to die. <laughs> Alright. Gotcha, Pidgey was caught. It rapidly flaps its wings in the grass, stirring up a dust cloud that drives insect prey out into the open. Do we think him to the Pidgey? Yes. We're gonna call him... Uh... I'm either the word or word. I'll just call him word. <laughs> just haven't you heard about the word. Well, everybody knows about the bird. Fight me. Hey there! Two trainers meet eye to eye. The battle begins. I realize Larvitar is getting above the rest of my team, as far as levels are concerned. Uh, I'm not really sure what I'm going to do about that. I may do some off-screen grinding, or make a montage, or something, I don't really know. But, right now he can pretty much just stomp on any enemies we run across. Well, that might not be too bad to just try and grind up things right now, because the other Pokémon are pretty low level, so it wouldn't be too hard. The tail on a Pidgey. Alright, let's just switch out into Ashley just to get some experience on her. And then we'll switch out into Ralts. Because Ashley has nothing that uh, she can do versus Pidgey. It's her only. Oh, well, not run. <laughs> Derp. Uh, Ralts' only attacking move is a ground type attack. Sand attack. Oh, that's annoying. Please don't miss. So please. Oh god. This is going to be awful, isn't it? Okay, thank you. Gonna keep using sand attack? Okay, well, if we can get one more hit, then Pidgey will go down. There we go. Screw you and your sand attack spam. <laughs> what happened? $64 reduced. Okay. Uh, I'm actually going to go heal my Pokemon, and so I'll, I'll, I'll cut here. You won't even notice. Actually, you will notice, because I said it. <laughs> Okay. We're fully healed now. Nice, nice healthy team. Let's actually take a look at our Pokemon. I haven't been doing that. Uh, nice Tackle Sand Attack. Leech Life Supersonic. Nice and garbage. The Snow's Pursuit. I guess that's kind of cool, but it'd be nice to have a normal type attack or Gust or something. There's some weird like movesets, like Mud Slap and Growl on Ralts. Pursuit on Talo. Alright. Uh, we just want to go straight up, right? To Oxalis? Yeah. Oh, item. Two paralyzed heals. Sweet. We haven't found anything that can paralyze us yet, but I guess that can always change. Oh, hey there. Can I interest you in a battle? I keep forgetting to put another Pokemon in front for switch training. Dr. Lewis sent out Nimmel. 
Yeah, let's go ahead and swap out right now, because I doubt there's anything that'll do too much damage to us. Tackle? Ooh, that hurt. Okay, well, we'll go to boss, because boss will resist that. Easy. <laughs> Dude, Larvitar is such a strong Pokemon to start with. Ooh, Growl? That's slightly annoying, so we'll have to switch out again. Which, I mean, I, actually, I guess we do that anyways, just because, uh... Because Switch Training, because they have another Pokemon. I want to get Ashley to have Confusion or something, which I think she gets at level 7? I'm not sure. Send it Vulpix. Actually, let's go ahead and try using her. Because she does have Mud Slap, which is super effective. But she is at half health. Tail Whip. Okay, we're definitely going to switch out because I don't want to get one shot by a tackle. And that doesn't do anywhere near enough. Although we could... No, we're not going to go into Pidgey or anything. We're going to keep using Boss. Just because, again, I don't want to really risk anything. Oh, we're going to keep going for Tail Whip. And down she goes. Very nice. Oh well, that was fun. <laughs> Give me that $100. Right, let's go ahead and use one of our potions. On... Uh, well... Actually no, I thought she was lower than that. She's okay. For the time being. Who's the biggest Pikachu fan? Look no further. Alright. I'll, I'll take your word for it. You don't need to fight me, bro. <laughs> what a derpy little sprite. I love it. <laughs> Double slap. Please. Get out. Oh, that static, though. Damn it. Well, we did get those two paralyzed uh, heals. Okay, it seems like when we switch train, we the EXP doesn't get split in half. Like, both Pokemon get like the full experience or something. Uh, where's Paralyzed Heal? There we are. We will use the potion on Boss though. So, gotta keep him nice and topped off. Education is the key to success. Preach it, brother. <laughs> Go to school, kids. Sends out Meryl. Go, oh, Bows. Okay, we're gonna switch out here. Go into... Like, Zoom's gonna be so hard to level, just because Leech Life is garbage. I guess I'll go back out into Ashley. Because the whole Gardevoir line is, like, a potent special attacker. Like, I mean, he says that as Meryl takes nothing, but... Oh, shit. Okay, good. I was not paying attention, so I'm super glad that that tackle missed. Because <laughs> that probably would have killed us, because Ralts' physical defense? Not very good. Plus, we were at minus one defense. Alright, we take that easy. Like, see, we both got 61 experience, but there's no way we would've got, like, 122 experience from that. Or 121, depending on how it split it. Pidgey, we will, will we switch? Yes, we will. I really want to get Ashley to level 7. Because, again, I'm pretty sure that's when she gets Confusion. Although it could be completely different, because Ralts definitely does not get Mud Slap normally. I just, well, this Pidgey's actually level 7, wow. Uh, so, looks like two more scratches should be enough to take it down. I wonder if we get a Sandstream or some other abilities to Renatar. 
Oof, almost leveled up. Youngster Wilson was defeated. No, I failed. $112 reduce. I'll take it. I need to do some thinking. My Pokemon hates me, and I don't know why. Probably because you suck as a trainer. <laughs> Oxalis City. Very nice. Hmm. This town sure has grown. I'm sure it has. Oxala City, the city for young, growing trainers. Hey, what a quinky dink. And a house with no door. Never understood that. Like, how do its inhabitants get in and out? Is there a door right here? Because I can't go in it. Maybe there's just a pathway through the, the trees or something? <laughs> there has to be more out there than what we're told about. Oh, wow. Too deep, dude. Too deep. Why do they sell brick pieces? I'd like a whole brick, not pieces. What? Sure, why not? Escape ropes come in handy inside caves. They sure do. How much money do we have? A thousand dollar reduce? Brick piece? A rare chunk of tile. Huh. I wonder what that's for. That's definitely not a normal item. And we've actually been coming across money really slowly, so I think we're going to have to be pretty frugal about what we buy. Fortunately, we do have quite a few Pokeballs left. Another doorless house. Another old man. There's some real arrogant people this day and age. Josiah is our local gym leader, and he can be described with one single word. Idiot. <laughs> Oxala City Pokemon Gym Leader. Josiah. Too hot to handle. So I assume he uses fire types then, because there's always some fire type pun. There's a woman living here. She can check how happy your Pokemon are. Okay. So I assume this is just like the happiness rater or whatever. Yep. I can score your Pokemon's happiness in an instant. Can I see your Larvitar for just a moment? Please? Hmm. Larvitar scored. Oh, so it gives you the exact numerical numbers. 95 out of 255. Grade D. Seems your Pokemon isn't used to you yet. Rude. Is that... Okay, that was the back of his head. I was like, was he wearing a mask or something? I tell you, this place... Like, if you're trying to be a nice person around here, you know, like, you say hello, or good morning, and it just blows up in your face. Leave me alone. Get lost, scrub. Don't touch me. I know peeps from Johto and Region. Way more chill. You say yo, and they're like, hey... So why are Najal people so stuck up all the time? I don't know. Asking the important questions. Shh. I'm beating my old high score. What? A trainer laughed at my Pokemon, but I think my Jigglypuff is the cutest. Maybe it's because they don't live in the wild region? Region? I'm from Sinnoh, and the Pokemon here are really different. I see a few familiar faces, but the wild is mostly different. Good evening, you're out late. Oh, yeah, thanks, I guess. Thank you for waiting. Your Pokémon are fully healed. We hope to see you again. This house has two underground passageways. It was built to connect, connect Oxalis with the mountains on Route 73. Lately, trainers have started to gather inside. One guy even gives away free Pokemon from time to time. That's cool, I guess. Oxala City, Rookie Trainer Hall, just the place for beginners. What is this? It's like a battle room? Well, hold up. Okay, another, another one of these areas where it's from the side. A stick? Isn't that for Farfetch'd? An ordinary stick. Sell low. <laughs> okay. A word of advice just for you, kid. It's better to train multiple Pokemon instead of just one. Yeah, I know. Even though I've not been doing that. <laughs> oh. What is this? Oh, it's a PC. Okay. Can we keep going up? Yes, we can. I have no idea how tough these 
trainers are going to be, so hopefully we're not going to just get wrecked. Huh. Shocked you, didn't I? Oh, is it going to be electric? Seems so. Pokemaniac Aaron wants to battle. Sent out... Mary. Okay. Level 7. Alright, that, that's, that's doable. I can deal with that. I'm going to go Mud Slap just to not get static, and it's super effective. Easy win. <laughs> so that'll bump us up to level 10, which is very nice. Ooh, Sandstorm. Doo -doo 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 -doo. <laughs> God, I lost. That makes me mad. 420 money. Okay. So I guess these guys give us a bit more, even though... Uh, the other guys were only giving us like $110 or so. What is it? Pokemaniac Paul wants to battle. Pokemon Pokemaniac Paul sent out Ralts. Ooh. Ralts versus Ralts. <laughs> they have traced and we have synchronized, so they traced our synchronize. And we all speed it somehow. Yep, okay, so it definitely gets confusion at level 7. That's good to know. Ooh, does a lot of damage for not being very effective. Uh, I almost don't want to switch out. Well, I mean, I will, but. I'll use Mud Slap one more time to lower that accuracy. Please don't crit me, please don't crit me. Okay, thank you. Okay. Go boss. Just dodge this, dodge this confusion. Good job. Ooh, nice. Okay, those those mud slaps paying off. <laughs> Level 7? Aw, oh, yeah. Aye! <laughs> Another $420. Since we're actually getting some money now, I'm gonna go ahead and just use a potion on Ashley here. Let's show she doesn't get one shot by something. Hopefully. With this theme, having lots of Pokemon helps you deal with multiple different types. Ultimately, you have no clear type weaknesses left. He has two Pokemon. Wow, no weaknesses. What a dude. Yanma, level 7. Okay, things are getting a little bit harder. We're gonna switch out just in case he has, like, Bug Bite or something dumb. I really wish I had a Rock-type move. I don't know when Larvitar learns one. Oh, he just has Tackle. That's fine. Let's actually use Sandstorm, because he has two Mons. And Leech Life, which is kind of annoying. Oh, that was even a crit and didn't do too much. I just want to get some residual damage on him. Break that focus, Sash. <laughs> you know, the animation for Leech Life is so long. Oh, look at that. Oh, that was a crit. Okay, I was hoping that would be just regular damage. Stop using Leech Life, oh my god! <laughs> He should be dead after the next scratch. Oh, never mind. The uh, sandstorm was enough to kill him. I thought he was gonna have like one HP left. Level eight. All right, cool. Wow, look at that. Two hundred twenty experience each. About to use trap inch. Ooh, it's gonna have arena trap, isn't it? Hmm. I guess we'll stay in. Hopefully, it won't have a ground type attack yet. I'm going to use a potion, though, just to be safe. It's going to be our last potion, so I'll have to go buy more. Sand attack. Oh god. We're going to stay in, but... We're going to use Mud Slap in return. If he's going to lower our accuracy, we're going to lower his accuracy. <laughs> oh god, it begins. No! I got it. Oh jeez. Please tell me we can switch out eventually. No, please stop! Okay, good, he missed his mud slap. Come on, thank you. Okay, he has sand attack and mud slap, so I'm not sure why he wouldn't just spam mud slap. I'm thankful that he's not. 
But I'm not sure why the AI wouldn't do it, because it's the same thing except Mud Slap does damage. They both lower accuracy by one stage. Okay. Fortunately, we were able to hit most of our attacks, and he was starting to miss most of his. Level 11. Super Nerd Bill was defeated. Ow, ow, ow. 256. So he had more Pokemon that were tougher, but gave us less money than the previous guys. Alright. No, no, not here. This way. That's interesting. Okay, so it's like a place to sort of grind up if you if you want some experience, I guess. And it's right next to the Pokemon Center, which is quite nice. Intentional, I'm sure. <laughs> we need to go get some, uh, some potions too, though. Wasn't the mart, like, down near the entrance somewhere? Up here? Yeah. Nice. Buy some potions, please. Let's get, like, five. Use up most of our money. Uh, can we actually go into the gym right now? Do we have to do any shenanigans? Oh, it's okay. It's definitely fire. I got orange this place is, though. Jeez. Hello there. I've been waiting for your arrival. Professor Elk has asked of me to assist you. I'll give you all of the inside info you need. Alright, Josiah has fire Pokemon, but you can tell by the scenery, right? Blazing. Water would be a good choice of Pokemon to use. Rock is another excellent choice. If you're getting burned out too often, try buying a burn heal at the market. Man, we have, we have mud slap, so we actually should be okay. Uh, Ashley is number one. Let's put, uh... Ariel and number one to get her some in levels. Should be pretty easy, she's kind of, ugh, since she's only level three. Is this a joke? Well, this should be a blast. For me? Oh god, please don't be super high level. I, I know like nothing about the uh, gym levels in this game. Frank sent out Houndor. Level eight? Oh jeez. Okay. We're definitely going to want to go back and uh and grind up in that place. Oh, no, we're, we're switching out. We're not <laughs> staying in on a level 8 Houndour. Oh, shit. Pursuit. We're dead. Rip. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, that is... That is unfortunate. I didn't even... That didn't even occur to me. Alright, well, we didn't have much choice, so... Ariel's dead. It's kind of a shame. I wanted to use a Swellow, because I've never used a Swellow on, like, an actual playthrough before. But I wasn't really emotionally attached, so another Hounder? Well, we've learned our lesson. We're not going to send another Pokemon into the Switch train. Level 9? Yeah, okay. We definitely have some grinding to do. Fortunately, we are doing really good damage with that Mud Slap, even though our physical attack is higher, I'm pretty sure. Cool Trainer Frank was defeated. <laughs> His name is literally Cool Trainer Frank. Or his uh, trainer class. Improbable! Yeah, well, you killed my tail, you monster. Okay, well, I think that is going to be it for today, guys. Uh, next episode, we're definitely going to go through that tower and grind up as much as we can, and then come back and take on the gym. So, with all that being said, take care. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace out. Ah, uh, yes, I almost forgot. We have to give Ariel farewell. This is going to be the first Pokemon getting put in the PC at all. Uh, Bill's PC. Can we rename the boxes? What's the last box? Because we're going to use that as the death box. Box 14. Name. Uh, what is that sprite next to box name? That's so weird. It's like missing now. <laughs> Dead. Uh. Aff. Pokemon are dead aff. <laughs> it will be saved, yep. Save over the previous save, of course. Deposit Pokemon. Aerial. 
rest in pepperonis. Okay, now for reals. Take care and peace out. <laughs>